this place called the Hopperbrook Forest where they do ecological research and they've been doing it for 60 years and they've collected a lot of data. What we're trying to do is use data from the Hubbard Brook Experimental Forest to tell stories about ecological findings. So ideally we're creating a website that will be used by teachers at Duke and possibly other universities where people can explore those data and get access to it even if they don't have programming skills. We're primarily using R, which is a coding language, and uh, Shiny, which is a package used in R to make applets that go on the web based on R code. All three of us are so different in what we're studying, but they tie so perfectly into our project. I'm a VMS major, so I work with Visual and Media Studies. We have an Environmental Science major, and we have a Stats major. So just from the composition of the team, we have different disciplines working together. I listen to this podcast called Data Stories. They interview like people who are doing data visualization stuff, and so many women out there uh, doing super interesting projects. So I, I think it's very cool. I feel it empowers you to be like, I can get there. And so I really like the idea that you can have a diverse group without gender diversity, which sounds kind of silly, but it shows that there's a diversity within each person. I hope the project becomes like a longer project, that it can survive, that people can keep adding to it. And so I think it's one way that people can learn about different things that are important to the world, such as acid rain and how human actions affect the earth.